Hey guys, in this call, this is a um, get the gas turned on and light the pilot. So I don't know what kind of furnace we have. Let's go in and take a look. See about this heat. Okay. All right. All right. Let's see. Uh, let's see what you got. Okay. Okay. Let me see. I'm gonna go outside and check your um your meter first. Okay. Okay. I'll be right back. Okay. All right. Let's go around and see if our gas is turned on. That is turned off right here, but it's not locked, so I can turn it on. I just have to advise water, gas, and light that I turned it on. It's okay. Yes, it is. It's okay. Yeah, you just a little puppy. Yes, you are. There's another one. Oh, y'all are sweet. Some kind of watchdog y'all are. Sometimes we turn these off and on as we work on systems. Like if we have to replace a gas valve or something, I might turn it off. When you turn it on, you turn it on slow. like that you turn it on too fast you can blow this regulator then you come over here and you make sure these two dials right here these are the ones that spin the fastest make sure they are not moving and they are not so let's go in and see about this furnace I got air in the lines. That's what I'm trying to get. The, I'm trying to get the air out. Yes, sir. I'm gonna have to go get my wrenches and bleed that line, okay? Okay. This is a new furnace. They used to have a either a wall furnace or a floor furnace with a vent right here. Not not in the floor, but sat on top of the floor. Right here. Now I 
smell it. Still ain't lighting, is it? There we go. Flame's starting to get a little stronger. That's what we want to see, a nice blue flame like that. Hold it down, let thermal couple heat up. All right, I'll release the button. get some bubble search and search make sure we don't have a leak here where I opened it up looks like we got a little bit of flame roll out hmm. all right let's get this to all right it should be ready in just a second all right we're reading zero out here it kind of smells like she might smoke in there so we might pick up a little bit of something No bubbles. <laughs> this keeps turning off for some reason. All 
zeros. Oh, that is really hot. Well, guys, I do hope you enjoyed that video. Um, I do want to mention that I continue using House Call Pro and QuickBooks conjointly, and it makes for a seamless operation. I can do everything from my payroll to billing out to estimates and send them to my customers via text or email. It's just a nice combination for me. It works out very well. I get, um, House Call Pro does the logistics of notifying customers and QuickBooks does the accounting. It just works out really well. I hope to have something better for you tomorrow. Um, so stay tuned for that. And tonight we're doing the um, HVAC nights. So if you want to tune in for that or look forward on YouTube, we're doing a live show tonight. I do hope you enjoy. And if you are interested in House Call Pro or QuickBooks, I have a link in the description. Check it out. I'll catch you on the next one.